Hey, what's up, people? It's Facebook Live, YouTube Live. To ask my webs, man. It's late. The big fight tomorrow. And I was thinking about, you know, who's going to win. My prediction. But uh, while I was thinking, I thought I'd share with you guys some ancient Chinese techniques in the mixed mar in the martial art of boxing. And um, I want to share this with you guys for no charge. You know, you, you can just monitor, you can actually um, um, join my page on um, YouTube, Robert Pelez Boxing. YouTube, Robert Pelez Boxing. Defense first. And I have all kinds of things on there, man. I'm just trying to share some love. So I'm going to go over how to punch. There's the mechanics behind your operation of punching. There's the mechanics behind your operation of punches. It's not just looking like you're doing what you're doing. Um, too bad it's a little bit too late for McGregor to get these points I'm about to show you guys. It's just one way of doing things. There's many different styles. Styles make fights. But I'm going to show you how to develop power. God has blessed me to be a power puncher. And it's not all about my strength. The strength adds on, but it's a mechanical thing too. Um, some people get it natural, like my son. He's a natural power puncher. Um, my other son, Tahi, who you guys should know, he's more of a um, technical situation. So that's what I see in McGregor, McGregor and uh, Floyd. Uh, but McGregor, you know, is way behind in technique. So let me show you a technique. First of all, to get power behind your punches, it has to be coming from your feet, your legs. So the first thing, you have to have your feet situated right. You got a view of my feet? Uh -huh. All the way down, get close. Uh -huh. Now the back foot, we're going to start with a jab. We're going to do the whole combination. When we throw the jab, and another thing, people make a lot of mistakes is the way your hands are at. Your hands have to be in position to land, to drop. You can't have your hands here and expect to have power. Power comes from your shoulders and your feet working from here. And you're punching down on your power, okay? So first of all, let's go to the feet. Let's go to the feet. And when I push off with my jab, I push off this back foot like that. When I push off with the jab going backwards, push off with that one. Now you gotta have, come on, please move. You gotta have a lot of strength when you, I said stop. When you, have, when you, when you push it, you got to be able to balance yourself and push all your weight in a smooth push like that, okay? Okay, the second thing is your body mechanics upstairs. First, your elbow has to be up and down like this, not bent. And when you, when you, when you release your, your punch, your jab, you have to turn it. Where it's going to twist like that. So when you twist it, it's going to... It's going to twist all together like that. Come back. It's perfect timing. It's practice over and over again. Okay. Now, when you put the feet into it and all together, it's going to cause an explosion. And the more motivated you are, the harder the punch will be. If I throw a soft one and I do it with the mechanics, it's still dangerous. You can see the mechanics moving. You can see everything moving. Just off a, a soft punch. Now if I put my weight into it and I punch harder, it becomes harder. Alright. Yeah. Same thing with your right hand. Same thing with your feet. It comes from the feet. You gotta push with that back foot, lift with the front. Okay. I'm gonna put it together for you. I'm a little tired, I ain't in shape, but I'm gonna try to put it together for you. Okay? Now that's gonna put myself in position for the left hook. The left hook is from when you when you land the one too, you're in this position here. And your foot should be up here. 
and your weight even, and you come back with the hook with a twist on it. Something like this. I like to drop down. I like to drop down to the body after that. That's what I was always taught. Body, head, head, body. Go up and down. So we're gonna go. We're gonna push with everything. This is increasing the power. Using your legs and your body together. To the body, I'm strongest there because I really let everything go. The more confidence that you're going to land the punch, the more your body weight and the more you push. And of course, the harder the punch is going to be because you get more velocity. So when I go to the body, I really let it rip. Okay? So that's another tip from Astro Wedge. Don't forget to monetize.